Alright, time for the grand finale, Captain. Somewhere in there. The Our princess is waiting. What a surprise. It's a comet. It looks like power stars weren't the only things getting eaten up around here. It looks like Bowser wants to get even bigger. You need to stop that Bowser before he devours everything in his path. Get in there and show him what you got. Yahoo! Hey everybody, grab yourself a Komi soda and stay a while because we're here with more! Super Mario Galaxy 2. In the last episode, we took on the Comets, the final Comets of the game. In this episode, we are going to take on the final Grand Star. Now, the first thing you're probably going to wonder is, oh my gosh, Komi, what the crap? Something wrong here. You've already done this galaxy, apparently, but it ha we've never seen it before. Well, that's because I had to do it off screen due to me wanting to be a perfectionist and make things really neat. So that's how that goes. Take this to your face, brown freaking hammer bros. Now you may also notice that I'm playing as Mario instead of Luigi, and that is because for the sake of all things good in this world, this is Mario's game. I mean, there is no Super Luigi Galaxy 2 as much as I would like there to be, so I cannot really use him for it. I mean, I could, I mean, obviously I could, but because of my plans, I can't really. It just wouldn't work out, which kind of sucks, really, because I'd like it to work out. I mean, you know, Luigi is the man. He is awesome. He's, like, my favorite. I prefer Luigi way over Mario, but I can't really do it, so that's sad. Whatever. Anyways, in this part of the galaxy, you may think, okay, go over there. Well, I'll tell you what I really think. You don't go over there. You break the game. That's what you do. You break the game just like this. Also, I believe, yeah, Mario's long jumps, I think, are actually shorter than Luigi's. I don't know. His seem lower and shorter, while Luigi's seems longer and higher. I don't know. I cannot really remember too much. I don't really remember the differences between Mario and Le Luigi. Luigi! All that much. So, yeah. Crap. Crap. I'm gonna die. That isn't good, dying in the final galaxy. That's really bad, in fact. Oh well, take this, dry bones. Take that. I hate dry bones, you can't really kill them. You can only delay the inevitable, which is kind of sucky. Die, even though you won't actually die. <laughs> oh well. Wall jump. And then, wall jump. Yay! I'm not going to go for that thing up there because really it's just a bunch of coins and that's kind of pointless anyways. <laughs> ha ha! Look at me being a platforming master. Take that. Yes. Mm. Okay, what do you got to say? Go on and save your special one and return to us safely. You bet I will, Luma. Luma, Luma, Luma. Oh, you're so cool. Mr. Luma Pants. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so, in this part of the galaxy, you just kind of want to go over here, and I'm going to waste my star bits on the Magikoopa, because the Magikoopa is a pain. I don't like Magikoopas. I don't like them one bit. So that's how that goes. Now, there is going to be some Yoshi usage in this galaxy, which is awesome, because, you know, Yoshi is awesome, and... I love the little extra beats kind of stuff that is added to the track when you're using Yoshi in these galaxies. So it's really cool. There's a one-up over there. Deers. Did I just say deers? I don't know. Oh god. Don't burn my butt. Please don't burn my butt. Stop that. You are not licensed to do that. Ow. Hey. Get, get back on the Yoshi. Get back on Yoshi. Get... No. None of that. And then over here is Mr. Speed Hacker Yoshi Mode. I love this part. This is awesome. I don't know, some people seem... Apparently some people have trouble with that. Maybe 
Maybe it's just because they're bad? I don't know. But that is one of my favorite parts of the galaxy, really. It's quite cool. It's like you're running away from walls of flaming doom and destruction. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so... See? Now we got a lava monster over there. That's why there's two sides. And we got another lava monster over there. We don't want to get hit by it, so we do that. Because if you get hit by it, first of all, you can't get the Comet Metal, which is over here. And the Comet Metal is clear like that because I have played through this galaxy already. So I'm sorry about that. There's not much I can do about it. But say that I am sorry. But you do need Yoshi there, so don't accidentally screw up and get burned and lose Yoshi. Because otherwise, you're not going to get that Comet Metal unless you uh, decide that it's a good time to take a little pain. If you know what I mean. <laughs> And here we go. Okay, this is the pole to eternity. Now, something very neat that I want to mention. If you get off Yoshi, this is the only time in the entire game where Yoshi will wave goodbye to you. Because this is the final boss. This is the final boss of the game. So that is really cool. You can't take Yoshi beyond this point. You can glitch the game and take Yoshi beyond, beyond this point by using an infinite flutter glitch. I don't really know how to do that, nor do I care to do that, but you can do it, so just, you know, know that you can, because that's pretty neat. But that is really cool that they have that there. It's kind of just a little little Easter egg that I never noticed the first time I played through, and yeah. So anyways, I'm going to break this, and I will see you on the other side. So, you might be thinking to yourself, Comey, what the hell did you just do? You cut at the final boss door and all this other crap, and that is not even cool, you jerk. I hate you. I'm going to unsubscribe now because you are so bad at what you do. Ah, and to that I say, we still, have got, we still have a comet to do before we actually, you know, beat Bowser to a freaking pulp. So we're going to do that. As soon as I get that time and hey bro no go die thank you <laughs> we still have a comment to do before we actually go beat Bowser to a pulp so we are taking care of that right the hell now and that ain't cool because I kind of have to use one of these things now in order to do the thing which is bad because it's kind of a pain in the rear really but yeah, this is a speedrun comet. It is one of the speedrun comets that involves. Uh, uh, think, thinking, thinking. What are words? I don't understand this concept of words. I'm gonna get hit by this guy in order to save some time, basically. By doing that because that is awesome. I like breaking the level. I've mentioned this before, and I just broke it. So, yeah, I'm happy. <laughs> but it's a really straightforward speed run. It's simple. It's effective. All you gotta do is get the clocks and finish the galaxy in a timely manner, such as this. Not be dead. Why? You know, we're going to give this another try. We're just going to give this another try. Like, like seriously, holy crap. I've been having such a hard time with this galaxy that it isn't even funny. So, I'm just going to give it another try. These things are going to die quickly and effectively because I really don't need to care about anything at all. Except getting hit by that boomerang because that really wasn't cool. But whatever. Give me the clock. Get up there. We're going down. Hey! This time I actually got some good air time on it, so it's not going to be too bad, as long as I get the clock. Hey, yay, I got the clock. I'm so happy, I want to party, I'm moving down, oh yeah. Woohoo! Oh. Clock for me, and then we drill our way down. I don't like speedruns. Like, I like speedruns, but I don't like speedruns. This is one of the speedruns I don't like, because for one, there's just too much crap involved in it, and for two, there's just too much crap involved in it. So that's why I don't like it. But, I'm gonna break the level again, because screw the rules, I am Luigi. I have a green hat, therefore everything makes sense. My headphones are kind of bugging my ear, but that's okay. Whatever. Hooray. 
Ah. Okay, let's try not to die this time, shall we? No! Holy crap, thank you. That would have been so bad, I hate that. Now, you might notice the star counter is a little inaccurate, considering this is actually the finale. But that's because, you know, I'm recording this a little sooner than need be. Why am I doing that? Because... Why not? Why not? No, really, I'm doing that, though, because I don't want to have inconsistent crap going on. Which is really the entire point of everything right now. So, Cloud Mario your way up to here like you have done before. Like I have done before. And get going. Because that is really all you can do. Wow, I've got a lot of time. I've been gathering all the clocks and it's just given me so much time to really get through this. This part, however, is going to be kind of a pain in the rear because, you know, if you screw up, you screw up. On the bright side, there's actually a flag this far through, which is really quite convenient. I mean, if there wasn't a flag here and you died, you'd probably be like, holy crap, I just want to freaking frack somebody in the frack. And that would not be good. But anyways, get over here, flutter my way over here. You will go die. You will freaking go die. Hey, did I say you could get up? No, I did not. Give me this. Thank you. Ah, oh, that's not good. But at least I got a head start, so I'm probably gonna make it, and it's gonna be okay because I am, I am, I am on a Yoshi. I am on a Yoshi. Oh, I am on a Yoshi. Whatever. No. None of that. <laughs> but yeah, this can be this can be a tricky part of everything because really just crap come on molten fiery lava thing appear before me so that I may go to the other side of the rainbow yay 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 give me the time give me the time to think about my actions and I will float on all right already We'll all float on. Oh, don't you worry. We will all float on. <laughs> that song is just so addicting, especially when you're using Flutter Yoshi like that. Or not Flutter Yoshi, just kind of like Floating Yoshi. I don't really know how to name that any other way, and I don't really know the official name. But whatever! We've got the star, so see you back here in a moment. Give it up already! Why won't you stop trying to mess up my awesome master plan? I'm building my new galactic empire right here, and you can't stop me. Why don't you just run off and find some green pipe to hide in? Mario! Can't you see that I'm busy here? I don't have time to chat, so let's cut this short, shorty. So this is the final Basil, but Basil? <laughs> what on earth is a Basil? This is the final battle with Bowser. This is very, very similar to the rest, the other freaking Bowser fights aside from him having all these lasers and stuff and them hurting but basically the idea is the same you wait for meteors to drop he punches the ground and then BAM try not to let him break it because that would be bad and then you just hit him just like that and it's all good it's it's delicious it's fantastic it's oh my gosh oh my gosh BAM hitting the ground again like a jerk <laughs> Oh well. He also breathes fire this time. I don't remember if he breathes fire in the other Bowser levels because it's honestly been that long because, I mean, anyone who's been following this LP knows that I've... As I was saying before, I cut myself off because cutscenes. <laughs> I've procrastinated this a bit, and I haven't really gotten it done in as timely of a manner as I should have, but that has changed recently, so it's all good. I am 
I am awesome, so it's okay. Do not, no, no, don't burn my butt, bro! I don't need any of that. I need a Skittle, but eating Skittles is kind of bad when you're trying to commentate. Take this! One more hit, and he's down for the count. Come on, get at me. You know you wanna. It's all you ever kill. Oh my god. <laughs> that hurt. That hurt my throat. That hurt my throat. When did I get a life shroom? Oh yeah, on the bow on the uh, Yoshi part. All right. With this final meteor, I will send you to the pets of hell. That is upsetting. How dare you do this to me? This is the real final battle, and it is probably my favorite Bowser battle ever. I always thought we would meet again. <sighs> Mama! I am Rosalina. I watch over and protect the cosmos. I have been waiting for all of you. When that evil monster took our star power, 
I was separated from my precious little one. But I knew we'd see each other again. Because... There is a force that binds us, defying even time and space. Not even the laws of the universe can stop it. I knew its gentle pull would prevail. It is the desire to be reunited with someone who is important to you. That pull is what brought us together. We have come through so much to meet again. This is not some mere whim of the stars. I am sure of that. <sighs> Mario. Thank you. I will never forget you. Even when I someday become a star myself, I will never forget you, Mario. Never ever. I won't forget. May the stars shine down on you. So the little one was reunited with a special someone. And you too, pal. Am I right? Alright, you two. It's time to get you back to your home planet. I don't particularly like to talk during credits, so I'm not going to. Therefore, enjoy them. Well, I said I wasn't going to talk, but I am going to talk a little while we're at this. There's something really cruel cool about the credits in this game, and that is, during them, you basically get to kind of play around on different parts of galaxies, which is really neat. Like, it's really neat. Like, for instance, this is, this is basically Supermassive Galaxy, and Peach is there, and you're there, and Mario's without his hat, which is honestly quite awesome. <laughs> and it's cool. It's very cool. It's very cool. And then we've got Lubba up here. I love her. And then we go back to the area with like, first of all you can get B Mario and talk to the little tree guys, I forget their name, that kind of sucks, but whatever. And you know, get B Mario, which is, this is cool by the way, this is cool, I can come up here and if I can help it, get these coins. Yay, coins, tasty coins. And play around with a snowball and stuff and just knock it right off the map. Because that's what cool kids do. Yay! I'm gonna just run this way. Whee! How far? Okay. Whatever. It's gonna shut up now.
so much for playing my game! Ah, good. Everyone's together now. <laughs> Next, let's hear a story about the jewels of the cosmos. Let me tell you a story of the green stars. This is a story from long, long ago.